Hello everyone! Welcome back to Teacher Ines Tutorials and Stories. Thank you for those who have watched my previous vlog about this topic, Zoom. Okay, now once again, I would like to say hi to my friends, Teacher G again, Marge, and to my dear students, Given, Francia, Miguel Pangindian, thank you for watching and hope you keep on watching with the other tutorials that I will be posting. Okay, now in my previous vlog about Zoom, I failed to include this because I told you that I will be including that in the video. Okay, I forgot already. I apologize for that. Now, when you click share screen, so this is the one that will appear. This is the dialog box. You need to enter your meeting ID after that you share. You click the button share or simply cancel it. Okay, now for today's lesson, I will be discussing what are the buttons on the toolbars when you entered already in your meeting. Okay, you have buttons uh, at the bottom. You have uh, you can unmute yourself. You can start a video. You can also invite others. You can see the number of participants that you have in your meeting or in your class. You can also share your screen and then chat and then leave a meeting. Okay, by the way, I got this reference from help this docs.iso.org. Okay, thank you for that. So as an educator, you need to acknowledge uh, even the pictures that you are getting from the internet because that is not ours. Okay, best practice, be sure you mute yourself while waiting that need meeting starts and if you are not speaking. Okay, so kahit po sa mga estudyante, my dear students, Habang naghihintay sa ating mga classmates or kay teacher, habang nag-prepare pa si teacher, so kailangan you mute yourself. Okay? So that is also part of being you are respectful or you are respecting your classmates at the same time, the host itself, your teacher. And for us teachers, professionals, whenever we are entering in any meeting, so please and uh, mute ourselves first okay and then we can unmute also if we would like to say something all right so continuation i will be discussing once you shared so ano naman po ang mga gamit nito makikita ito pag nilagay natin mamaya so part of my discussion ano po ang gamit nitong buttons na to sa ating discussion okay so uh, I really like this application, Zoom, kasi nga, as I mentioned, nagagamit ko siya sa aking mga estudyante for my online class. Okay, gustong-gusto nila, gustong -gusto nila ito kasi nga, pwede silang makapagsulat, uh, draw, or anything. Pwede din ma-erase and other things. Okay, so uh, do not forget to click the subscription button and keep tuning in. Okay. Now, um, what I will be doing is I will be sharing my screen. So, kunwari, earlier, ito na yung, uh, kunwari, ito, papakita ko yung um, Zoom, kung paano i-download, i-discuss ko, kunwari. Now, nakikita nyo po dito sa taas, may isa, dalawa, tatlo, apat, lima, anim, pito, walo, sham. Okay, there are nine buttons on top. When you are sharing your screen, paano po siya lalabas? Simply, Hover, okay, your mouse, and then makikita nyo po dito sa taas. And mute is you can mute yourself. Now, on this case, I have different uh, microphones with me. You also have a speaker and a lot of things. And under this video, so pwede mo pong alisin. Pwede mong uh, i-change um, virtual background later on after this discussion. I will show you how to do that. And then security purposes, and then the number of participants, and then if you want to share another, you want to pause it. Now, annotate, and then remote control. Now, eto muna po tayo, annotate. Ano ang gamit nito para yung sujante or ikaw po ay makapagsulat? Una, halimbawa, may tanong ka, kunwari, what is this? So, you are writing already, and kung ang sujante mo ay alam ang gamit nito, Okay, pipindito niya lang yung annotate, 
Okay, you will just click annotate. Then after that, pipili po siya dyan. Kung gusto niya ng text, if gusto niya mag-draw ng shape, okay, so rounded, uh, this is rectangle, or kung gusto mo ng circle, okay, oh, sorry, circle, kunwari, circle, yan. And you want to add on, I usually use this for my um, kids, sa studyante ko for my online class. Also, spotlight, that's it, arrow, Okay, next, eraser, kung ayaw mo na sa kanila. Okay, erase it. And then, we will erase it. And then, if you want to change the format of the color, pwede din. So, arrow natin para makita nyo. Oops. Okay. Disable lang po natin yung eraser. And then, may kita natin. Ayan. Uh, and then, arrow. It was purple already. You can undo it. Okay, you can redo it as well. Now, Ang, ang kagandahan po dito, haliba, be sure every time you inserted any object, click natin yung close. Okay? Pag click mo yung close, if you scroll down, makikita niyo mo pa po yung mga add-on objects such as text, shapes, and other things. So, what you need to do is go back again to annotate, and then you have three options here, clear all drawings, clear my drawings, clear view, viewers' drawings. Ibig sabihin nyo, nakikita lang ng doon sa estudyante mo or nung um, participants mo. So, gusto ko lang alisin ito lahat. Okay? Para walang um, sagabal sa screen ko. Or, kung gusto mo naman may sinusulat ka, save that. Okay? Close it. Now, I will stop sharing this because I will show again okay, another screen which is the whiteboard. Ang kagandahan nito sa whiteboard, uh, this is a free... Um, white screen, kung saan nakikita nyo dyan, yung pwede mong pasulatin yung sudyante, pwede ka din mag-draw, okay? Kung ano ang gusto mo, um, circle, triangle, if you are uh, dealing with young kids, star, okay, pwede kayo. Bawa, may sinulat ka dyan, and then you pinapa-identify mo sa bata, so pwede din. So, madami pong uh, magandang gawin dito sa Zoom. Actually, I like this um, applications when I am teaching, teaching with kids, okay? Even my kids, even yung mga studyante ko, mas gusto nila ito because I'm using Skype and then Zoom. So, mas maganda ito kasi may interaction din sa bata. Okay, pag gusto mong mayroon kang copy, so definitely you need to save that, okay? And then it will be saved to your location that you prefer, okay? And click, click close after that, you stop sharing and then it will go back to your screen again. So, as simple as that, dapat alam nung participant ang gamit nung annotate. Oh, by the way, may nakalimutan ako. So, uh, when, you're done, uh, when you're done sharing, so, dito naman po pala remote control. Hindi makakapag-navigate, hindi makakatype yung sudyante mo or other things kung wala, you did not give mouse keyboard control. Okay? But please, in, um, giving permission, hindi lahat. Okay? Kung madami kang sudyante. Kung isa lang, okay lang. Okay? Kasi um, there is a high chance na yung sudyante panay um, laro na lang. Okay? So, nag-scribble lang siya dyan. Okay? Next. So, click natin yung X button and then on this side, yung more. Okay, wait lang. Yung more. So, meron pa po ditong chat record, and then other things na pwede mong gawin. Okay? And then, we will end this part. Now, you have an option again, if you want to end meeting for all, lahat wala na, hindi na makakabalik unless you open it again, or ikaw ang unang aalis. Cancel muna natin, and then stop sharing. Okay. Now, kanina sinabi ko, tuturuan ko kayo for virtual background. So, punta po tayo dito, virtual background. So, kung gusto nyo merong mga design-design, okay, sa background nyo, inalis ko na yung um, design, design ko dyan. Okay, but it is good kung ang background mo daw po ay green. Okay, kasi tingnan mo para kang may spotlight dyan or nawawala yung mga parts ng katawan mo. Okay, so eto yung pangit. Uh, be sure na ang likod mo, okay, likuran mo daw po ay green. Okay, so ayan. At madami pa pong iba. Okay? 
So, I can choose none if I don't like. Okay. Okay na po. Or you can also change your profile. You can edit it. Okay. So, at madami pa pong iba dito sa setting ang pwede mong magawa. Okay. So, yan lang po. Ngayon, yan lang po ang gamit ng Zoom. So, maganda po siya. Lalong-lalo na sa young learners. Okay. So, with this, Thank you for your cooperation. Thank you for watching my channel. And I hope you can also share it with your uh, friends and other co-teachers. Okay? Bye!